Welcome to Open Air Live and Local on CPT 12. I'm Jesse Witten, tonight's host from Colorado Public Radio's new music station, Open Air. Every week we take you behind the scenes to show you how we work with Colorado artists to create one-of-a-kind recordings for radio in the CPR Performance Studio. Today we'll be dedicating the entire episode to Tennis, a band that spent a lot of time in the studio over the years. Originally from landlocked Aurora and Arizona, the merry duo of Elena Moore and Patrick Riley have established an identity as songwriting sailors. Their debut album, Cape Dory, documents an eight-month sailing journey on the eastern seaboard on a boat named Swift Ranger. With their sophomore album, Young and Old, Tennis found themselves in an entirely different environment. Instead of the solitude of the sea, the band was touring nonstop, going new places, meeting lots of new people, and the record reflects the massive changes they were experiencing. In 2015, following the release of their third full-length album, Ritual and Repeat, the band came in to tell us what they've been up to in the four years since their debut and play some new songs for us. The first performance we'll see today is one the band say they love playing live because it creates an intimacy between them and the audience, making it a perfect place for us to start. Here's Tennis with Bad Girls. Good. 
describes that track Timothy as her Taylor Swift revenge song about a writer who wrote something unpleasant about their band. She told us that's the last thing she'll ever read about the band, proving all of her musician friends right who warned her never to read press. I'm Jesse Witten, and we're dedicating this episode of Open Air Live and Local to digging into the music of Denver duo Tennis. We're about to get into their newest album, Yours Conditionally, a record they truly took into their own hands. 
recording it by themselves in a cabin in Fraser, Colorado, and then self-releasing the album, foregoing a record label for the first time in their career. Some of the tracks on this record go back to their roots of reflecting on time sailing the ocean. This next song was first conceived while the couple were sailing in the Sea of Cortez. It's reminiscent of the isolation they feel while traveling, with lyrics coming directly from Elena's ship notes. Here's Fields of Blue.
That was Please Don't Ruin This For Me from our focus band of the episode, Tennis. In describing why they decided to record, produce, and release this album on their own, Patrick Riley told CPR's Open Air they wanted an album that was truly their identity. Elena Moore added that they didn't want the pressure of pleasing other people, and they did it for the same reason they go sailing. They wanted to be autonomous and rely on themselves. Their next performance is a song that reflects Elena Moore's experience of what's expected of her as a professional musician. She noticed a persistent assumption that she was just a lead singer rather than a songwriter or a core contributor to the music. Here's tennis performing Ladies Don't Play Guitar in the CPR Performance Studio.
That was our final video for this episode, highlighting the work of Colorado favorite Tennis, performing Modern Woman from their newest album, Conditionally Yours. Last spring, the duo bought a new sailboat, so one can only imagine what songs we can expect from their next sea adventures. That wraps up this open air live and local, a half hour of videos of Colorado musicians as recorded in the CPR Performance Studio. You can hear music and interviews from our many sessions at openaircpr.org or on the radio at 102.3 in Denver or 88.3 in Fort Collins. Thanks to CPT12 for their support of the local music scene and open air live and local. Some things down on a list under the head of things to fix. It's wrong, I know, but I can't let go. Some days I can't think what to do. My thoughts are all consumed with you. It hurts, I know, but I can't let go. Till